two and a half minutes. Three days, unless you hear from me. From the moment this movie starts, you're put through the ringer, you're diving deep down a very dangerous rabbit hole. We're we dealing with the crash and bash. Poor man team. I'm a detective in major crimes investigating this robbery. First time being robbed? No pun, right? It's just so brilliantly written, and it's it's incredibly cool. Major Crimes will be heading up the investigation. Oh, Lee yeah, Belmont, yeah. fair with Chris. Hey, sir, can we talk about this? Hell no. <laughs> Poor man crew. Who's that fourth guy? Chris Allen, my role, is becoming a part of this gang unit, which is full of people who are corrupt. Your job, out monster the monster, and get home at the end of the night. I was not sure you could pull it off. We've done the job, pay the money. There is a second job. What do you want? There's a tenuous nature of this group where the stakes are just impossibly high. There's another job. She said she'd kill every last one of us we don't get this thing. They get dragged into a robbery that's much larger than what they've ever done. Do you know what this is about, Michael? It is about exile or death. Then everything kind of falls apart. We could pull a 999. When a cop goes down in a line of duty, they call out a triple nine over the radio. A 999 gets called in. All units in the area convert on a down officer. They don't have a problem taking out a cop. <laughs> I do a cop just like him. There's got to be a different way. It's all complicated and messed up and violent. <laughs> It's all connected is what my character is trying to figure out. Somebody's cleaning up after himself, and my bet is he wears a badge. It's the emotional twists and turns of the film that really got me. Does anyone believe maybe something very big is about to go down? The best thing is you never know who's going to get it. You never know who's the good guy and who's the bad guy. There was something about this that was very, very pure. I'm going to find out what you're fixing to do. Your heart is racing through the entire thing. It really is brutal and horrible and quite shocking. There is no limit to what desperate men will do when pushed.